Shall we begin? That's how it's supposed to be. Chevy pulling a Chevy. It's the drag racing stuff. I'm not really into that much. Could care less. Got two sets of pipes. One with the normal exhaust on it and then a little turnouts to uncap the headers with right there. Where they can run it faster without any back pressure. See what this is supposed to be. Stickers all faded out, and I know it didn't fade in two days. Some nice wheels on it, anyway. Kind of like those. That's interesting. Don't always see that with the back door like that on them. Pretty simple interior as usual. Alright, Nash Rambler. Oh, Nash Rambler American, excuse me. 1960. That lime green paint is something else. Look at that. Of course they went stupid with this one too and put the wide rear end under it. Little bitty car. That thing's about narrow. You couldn't fit two of me in the back end of that, that's for sure. Wow. And you got somebody that done theirs up for their Nova 2 up for racing. Some nice little wheels on it. According to the shifter, it's got a six speed in it. Now, this is the one my dad would want to fight somebody over. Fifty seven Bel Air. Obviously not much of stock on this one. Ohio car, which means it has to be being kept in a garage. There's no two ways about that. Looks like it might have been a drag car before because it's got the hood pin holes. The pins are gone. Looks like somebody's trying to put it back stock. And parts are not cheap and really hard to find, so 
Not sure what this one is yet. Now let's get a look at the old rat rod. Got a modern day Chevrolet uh, steering wheel on it. Not completed. Plymouth. That's good. Plymouth with Chevy parts on it. Well, that's a heck of a way to improve the value. Thirty-seven Plymouth Coupe of Independence, Kentucky. There's another take on a hideaway license plate. Just put it on the bottom of the car and put your little cable on it to retract it. the billet stuff. Doesn't ruin a car, it just doesn't look all that hot. 1940 Ford Coupe. And unlike some of them, this one is actually being put back original. Here's one of them that looks like they done it backwards. They wanted to put a rumble seat in it, which what a lot of them do with these kind of cars. Latch needs to be on the top side. It needs to flip back. Again, I'm not sure on this one. I like these old cars. I just don't know what each one of them are by the body lines. I actually have to cheat and look at the labels. 34 Chevrolet. for dad. I don't care nothing about the gold emblems either. They sh should have got gold or chrome on them. Put it back original looking. Cause this thing is too pretty to be putting all them fake parts on, or aftermarket stuff. Just my opinion now. An old AMC wagon. Rambler again, it's a newer Rambler. 70s, if I remember correctly. way off. Okay, Chevy Apache. Chevy Apache. Maybe was really impressed with those. That one I like. Took pictures of this one. Somebody watches too much horsepower TV. That's just like their aftermarket mod resto or whatever the hell they called it. Seven Corvette hardtop convertible 
Four in the floor. Another one I can't get my big butt into. Nice. Oh, the first Pontiac. 19. Nineteen thirty-seven Pontiac. Got their trash laying everywhere. That's nice. Got a modern day steering column in it. Not good. in the class of their aftermarket stuff they put in it. It's got a Cadillac steering column in it. Not positive. It kind of looks like an old Packard. DeSoto. 1947 DeSoto. There you go. Old Anglia. They're not the aggravating mess. They're not the same wheels that are on the front that are on the back, but I like those ones on the front. Those are cool. This thing's a little short, stubby car. Don't see many of these here in the States. And that thing is beautiful. Now this one's not restored. Well, it's restored, it's not painted. Another Anglia. Don't see them in the States, but here's two of them. Of course, this one he did like I just can't stand seeing done. Stubbed it and put them big old ugly tires on the back. Got that cracked wind or cracked glass there. Nice wheels. My baby. Yeah, he done this one up for racing. So this one is a 52 Anglia. This one is a 48. Not that much different. 